and today we are here with Jace who is a French UK artist UK trap I want to say trap okay Ivorian artist funny story funny funny story yeah he went to my primary school like this guy actually went to my primary school and I know her name would you? Oh, okay. Oh, really? On camera. Basically, I have like a Muslim name because I was born a Muslim. So, and he he always claims, "Oh, I know your name. I know your name. I'm gonna expose you." Expose you then? Like, I don't care. Lamy. No, wait. I didn't actually. Wait, wait. wait. No, I didn't actually mean. It. I didn't actually mean expose me. Oh, do you, I, okay, I don't really care. No, it's it's Lamiat. It's because I was born Muslim, but. Anyways, um, yeah, so I asked him to come through and yeah, like, how was I, you see the way I do my interviews, were I, was I not like that in primary school? Like, how was I in primary school? Um, rude. Exactly. I've yeah, always been, true. so people who say, oh, why is she, I've always been like this, I've always, and in it, I used to be the leader of everything. Sure, yeah. I used to be like the it girl in it. I was the it girl. I, in year six, I was the it girl. So, yeah, now to the, you, 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 Do you know what? There was two Jasons, so no one really knew you. Like, you I wasn't really... Chill out, man. You wasn't uh, really, like, the Jason of Jasons. Like, there was, like, a Jason, then there was the other Jason, and you were the other Jason. Let's be real. That's taking you know, that, you know that, No, you, you kind of knew that was true. Okay, so, describe yourself and your music in one sentence. Um, I'll describe myself as a... Um, a UK international artist because obviously my music's proper known, like it's really known everywhere else other than the UK. Wow, so, that's wait, wait, wait. Are you, do you feel what you just said? Like, so why is okay before we get into that because that's a, your music's not known in the UK, but nah, not too tough. Why do you think that is? Um, I don't know because obviously I'm rapping in French and English, so people are thinking I'm a French artist mm -hmm. rapping in English. But it's the other way around. Yeah. Like, and plus, I'm not even from France. I'm from Ivory Coast. Okay. So, so um, what would you like classify your genre? Like, what kind of, like, because I know there's French trap, there's French Afro French, there's Afro. What Afro is trap? French trap. There's trap. Many. There's African trap. Like, there's many different traps. But what I do, I don't know. Like, I'll just call it UK trap for now. Just why did you it. like why do you believe like you went for, for French trap instead of any other like genre like, why did you go for because if we're being real it doesn't really what? bang like um <laughs> wow well, 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 wait no no I mean like in terms of no it bangs yeah like but, but to me well, it doesn't bang in the UK yeah it doesn't bang in the UK yeah, that's like, fair so, enough. but everywhere else it bangs so so you're not trying to, so where you grew up from, you're not trying to blow there first? And then nah, do you know what it is, yeah? I feel like everyone in our scene right now, yeah, it's just trying to, like, copy each other and just mm. trying to, like, because obviously everyone's got their group, there's, like, yeah. there's a new thing called Afro Swing now. So mm -hmm. everyone's just trying to go into that little thing because it's blown a little bit. But so you won't know. go into the Afro? What's wrong nah. with the Afro Swing? Afro Swing is calm, but that's not my thing, in it? Like, I can do everything. I won't just, like marginalise myself mm -hmm. to just afro trap like, so um, what do you mean though like in terms of because people some people don't know what afro swing is like for instance j Huss, i think j Huss is afro swing mm -hmm. I, yeah i kind of think he's afro swing but i don't feel like j Huss just does afro swing like i feel like he can do a lot of things that's that's the same thing with me but the same the thing with me i just add a bit of friendship that's mm. it like, me and him are basically like identical, but the only you're thing, identical to J Hart. You're seeing. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying I'm identical. <laughs> I'm not claiming that. Like, come on, man. I'm not saying I'm not J Hart. I'm just saying like, in terms of 
like versatility and stuff like that. Yeah. On that type of mm-hmm. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Do you believe it's easier or harder, like in this genre that you're in? Um. And why? Well, I find it easy. You find it easy to blow more in what you're doing. Yeah. Why is that? Because there's more attention to it all, right? Mm. Like it's not in the UK yet because obviously it's a new thing. Yeah. So I'm I'm trying to be that person that brings it here. Okay. Your single, Ronaldinho, mm-hmm. like um, despite the obvious, like who, what inspired this and who inspired, like what inspired you to do this? Like despite that, obviously he inspired you, but. Right, cool. So um, I wrote this track on the train journey, so it took me like an hour, two hours. So this track was supposed to be a freestyle. Mm-hmm. It's not supposed to be anything serious. I didn't plan on like, taking it seriously or anything, but I dropped it on SoundCloud. It got a bit of reception and I dropped it on YouTube just recently and it just took off. So. What made you want to rap about him? Like? Do you know what it was? Yeah, I just like, obviously, I got, I got sent the beat. Well, I saw the beat myself and I hollered the producer and he's my official producer now. Okay. So um, I hollered him, I was like, yo, like. I'm feeling this beat, like, can I have it? Mm-hmm. So obviously, got it from him now. Listen to it over and over again. All I'm hearing in my head is Ronaldinho, Ronaldinho. So I'm just thinking, all right, cool, let me just put this in the, the hook and then go from there. That's how I done it, really. It was random, like, I can't really say, all right, if there's any inspiration, but what I will say is that the track, even though it was random and a freestyle, the track is, like, based of I wanted to be a footballer, so mm-hmm. I was doing well in football. But an accident happened, found myself in intensive care, red tete, mm-hmm. and then boom, from then I was like, nah, I can't lie. Okay, so for those who don't know, what exactly were you saying that? And after this, we're going to play like a game. So, what exactly were you saying in this? Um, like, in the, in the verses, what were you saying? Um, I basically just, like, just, it's so random that like, people get on me because of my French in it, but. The thing is, yeah, I didn't even think it was gonna get any far, like anywhere. Mm-hmm. So I just done my thing on it. So basically, I'm just talking about um, a girl, basically, like okay. gold diggers, okay. and how I'm saying that one day I'm gonna be worth a million. Right, okay. like, I'm just, it's like I'm speaking on my life now, but mm-hmm. I'm speaking things into existence okay. at the same time. So. All right. So okay, there. now we want you to say or rap something that's not in your song in French to me. Like say, say or rap something. It has to just can't just be a word, like say a sentence or that like random. Yeah. Or does that have to be Yeah, but don't take the piss. No, random about me. Oh about you? Yeah, don't take don't Oh that's a bit mad. Um <laughs> If you, uh, you know I'm in French speakers. Uh? Yeah, so I want you to say something like, mm, a ra- not just something about me. It has to be in French, and I know French speakers, so you okay. can't take the piss. What do you mean something about you, though? Like, I don't know. Um, I'll just be general. Okay. For people out there that might be interested, in something to make a song about you. Because of what? Nothing. Nothing. Carry on. Um. Chérie, on est là, on est là, pardon, dépêche-toi. J'ai déjà bouclé une table. Laisse ta carte, tu ne dois pas ça. Cette nuit, c'est toi et moi. Tu m'as servi l'eau que j'en ai, quand j'avais rien à boire. Ok, uh, ok, carry on. You know, can someone in the comments please tell me what you said? Please tell me what you said, like, please, because I know this nigga ain't. <laughs> Uh, I hope not. Okay, someone's gonna say what you said, so... It's calm, it's nothing bad. Okay, cool. That's what I've... I've literally done this exact same thing and a p- person did say something bad, Ah, so. that's nice, man. Okay, so, um... Watching, like, reaction videos, um, how did you... Because there's a reaction video of your... with the Americans, two guys. How did you, like... Like... Were you happy about that response that they um, gave? Obviously, like... Bear in mind, I'm trying to make a transition from just like a normal guy to the mm-hmm. artist world, isn't it? So when I see things like that, it takes me back a little bit. But I'm like, ah, right, this is gonna come. Let yeah. me just get used to it, take it on board. But it was nice though. It's mm-hmm. calm, obviously, they're all the way from the states. Yeah. 
and that's like a normally if they react to people on their channel it's like people that are popping yeah so my name must have popped up somewhere mm. for them to react to it do you agree that afro trap is underrated and why nah do you know what it is yeah like if you listen to it right, cool say mhd for example a yeah. big french artist yeah does afro trap the person who started afro trap yeah in the europe scene kind of thing he's he's gone like he's all over the world like mm. it's not a small thing yeah just that to the uk it's a small thing yeah why do you think that is though like because i don't know i think it's because we don't no understand one, it no it's not even that no one here does afro trap who here does afro trap well i guess you no apart from him. Like no one else. No one else. Yeah, so obviously they don't, they don't, they don't like know about it. Yet. So yeah. when they do get to know mm -hmm. me yeah. and my music, then I'm 100 percent sure people will get on it. But for now, it's calm. I'm just waiting. Okay, so we recently saw you tweet Jace slash with SK. Mm -hmm. So is this something that we should look out for? Like, no, this? no, no. Why would you tweet it then? No, no. That's just between me and Source in it. Because we saw you tweet that and we started thinking, oh, okay, this No, obviously, SK is a good guy. Like, I feel mm -hmm. his music, but obviously, that's not like, anything official or anything. Oh, okay. That's just, just me saying, yo, I want to go Yeah. Okay, then. Um, what, like, is the insides behind your next, like, release? Because we saw you hashtag him more. Monaco. Monaco yeah, and stuff yeah, like yeah. that. So, what, is there something we can know about that? Yeah, um, so basically, I'm starting a new freestyle series. Okay. It's called Only Vaha. Huh? So in French, on Yvain means like, let's go. Okay. So my slogan, not my slogan, but my thing is called on Yvain. Huh? So this is going to be like a episode one. Okay. And it's basically an anthem for different cities. And it's current. So anything that happens, I'll rap about it. And okay. Make it an anthem. Okay, so, that's interesting. So yeah. what do you have coming like up like that we can, we can know about like what would you give us an insight to for this summer or any shows um, lined up? In terms of me releasing anything, boy, I've got a couple of stuff, you know. Um, I've got an EP coming, but that's around all the September time. Okay. I've got um, this Monaco thing coming soon, a couple of weeks. Um, I've got another tune called Cataleo. What does that mean? Um, have you watched the film Colombiana? I've heard of it. Zoe Zardana. No, I haven't watched it. Alright, cool. It's just, a, it's just like a song. Okay. Basically, that's gonna be to people who've done me wrong in it. Like, the, oh, okay. The link up the. Okay. All right. So I li I just you know when you have to go back and like did you whisper? It's funny how you whispered that one as well. No, nah, I won't whisper it. It's calm. Like what, everyone knows. What? Like, link up to you are pricks, innit? Like, how? Cause bit. Tell me the story. story. Obviously, like, first, I'm going to start with my advice to new artists in that. Don't, don't post on lip card. Don't post over their card. Real <laughs> talk. Obviously, everyone's trying to make their money. And the thing is, yeah, I'm, more, like, I'm not trying to go for link up. They're doing their thing. Okay, why, okay, up, why should... They need platform. to know why they should up. It's just, like... Because people feel like if you post on link up TV, and you ain't got a fan base, it'll... Yeah, it, it builds a fan... I think but that's true, though. As soon as you put your stuff on Link Up TV, that's their... That's their they've got their money. That's you lost in the source. Many, many mm. different uploads after that. But if you upload on your own channel, then you control everything. Because, yeah, what I, what I have noticed is that everyone's starting to do this own channel thing. Mm. Like, I've seen a lot of Afro Swing artists trying to... Is that like, probably why? Because Link Up's taking everyone's money. I don't know, like, it's just... Um, so how are they pricks if they It's just, I right, cool. They're not pricks here because I haven't dealt with anyone at Link Up TV. But the person I dealt with didn't deal with it properly. How it's supposed to be dealt. I felt like he thought like, cause this is my first time doing oh, yeah, a shoot, yeah. my first song. Like they thought like they can take a piss. But obviously I know my thing. Like I come into the music scene, I know what I'm going into. Yeah. So they didn't do things properly. They so basically, your next song is about Link Up, basically. Not just Link Up. Like there's. Other people try. So link up should basically um, watch out to that song because you're basically. Yeah, I don't French. mind, man. I don't mind. It's all good. Okay. I, I just, yeah. That's my advice, isn't it? Just go on your own channel. Just go on your own, own and just build your own fan base, basically. Basically, that's yeah. good. I think that's good advice. I feel like people should take to that advice. Um, so you did tell me from before that what you have someone someone out there trying to <laughs> copy your song. 
But like a couple of people, like I woke up this morning, yesterday even, I saw it. I'm gonna mention his name in a minute. I saw it. I was like, whoa, like this this looks so familiar. Mm -hmm. And then How did it look familiar though? Because obviously the whole like I'm not gonna say it like he's he's taking my whole thing, but I feel like he knows what I'm going with my thing. Mm. Maybe he doesn't, maybe it's just me yeah. thinking thing, overthinking, but he knows what I'm going with my Ronaldinho song. And he's gonna done so like a So who is this? Gecko, like, come on, man. The Manchester guy. The artist. But do you know what? Because I just um, interviewed someone from um, CXTV. What they said is that before they took um, um, SK song, they didn't know. So mm. imagine if he didn't know that oh, there's a song. No, but with them, they, SK said that he they, they spoke. Yeah, so that's that. a different. I kind of clocked that as well. When I was interviewing him, I was, I was like, I clocked that after. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's any hey, that's not my business, but yeah, he hasn't spoken to me. I don't know the guy, mm -hmm. but I'm just saying, like, a couple of people are at me and say, Yo, like, why does this sound so similar to your thing? And I'm not gonna be here and sit down and say, I'm, I'm a new guy in the scene at the end of the day, mm -hmm. but if someone's got like a popping tune yeah. and then you've okay. seen it, so what did he do? The whole French thing, you don't know, do he can't do the French thing, so he just called it Ronaldinho, like, no, he called it Ronaldo. Oh. Like, I know, like, I might be overthinking. You might be. But. You're probably not. It sounds similar. Like, people are telling me it does. Like, yeah. I, it's not only me that's saying it. It's a couple mm. people that have told me, so, you know. Okay, your messages that you were sending to me before all of this. So, like, clearly you wasn't feeling up this setup. Clearly you wasn't feeling it. Why is that? I don't understand, man. Like, I don't know, man. It just looks like. Looks like what? Look, the way I raised my voice, looks like what? I don't like. I prefer the other setting, like the setting so far was calm. Like this one, I just feel like. Feel like what? Like it's like a prison sentence visit. Like, I'm, not, I'm not prison, you come to visit me in Tokyo. Like, I don't know, man. I like don't I like know. the colours and stuff, but I feel like. I you know, should go back to the sofa thing still. I, I, that looks calm. That looks so calm. But who, who even are you? Like, Honestly, like, like I'm. Before the music thing, I was a fan, I was watching your thing, I was giving you a couple of advice you weren't taking it, but it's calm, like... I'm here, I weren't taking it. As a fan... What advice were you giving me? I was saying, yo, like, keep doing your thing, innit? Like, you wanna go down the route, people saying you're too rude, keep doing it, it's calm. But I just think this setting is dead. Do you know what you should do? I prefer the sofa. Do you know what you should do? I prefer it, though. You should go on Link Up TV and try get an interview. That's what you should do. I don't mind, man. Don't you don't mind, but you're just trying to show about them. I don't. Yeah. Anyway. So what? I won't get interviewed by them. Not now. Not not after this comes out. I don't mind that. Like, me and Nick up TV are finished anyways. That's not. Where can we find you in terms of social media? Um, all my social media is just Jace Music. Okay. Yeah, my Snapchat's Jace Official One. That's about it. Really. All right. Well, that's enough for me.